Yes, Europe. No Russian law read a banner outside the Georgian parliament. Over a sea of 20,000 protesters in central Tbilisi. This against the so-called foreign influence law, a law many Georgians see as a Russian import designed to stamp out dissent. There is an unprecedented number of people gathered here. We, Georgians, can be hungry or thirsty, but the freedom and dignity is what matters the most. That's why we are standing here. Opposition lawmakers boycotted a parliamentary vote on Wednesday, but not without fierce debate. How dare you? What moral right do you have, you, the Russian agents, to call this country's patriots, people who have been defending the people and honor of this country for years, how dare you call them foreign agents? The bill won a comfortable majority with the votes of 83 out of 150 MPs. Put forward by Georgia's ruling party, the bill is marketed as a way of combating so-called pseudo-liberal values imposed by foreigners. It would force media and non-commercial organisations to register as pursuing the interests of a foreign power if they receive more than 20% of their funding from abroad. And EU foreign policy chief Joseph Borrell confirmed what many Georgians fear, that the bill does not align with EU values and as such would compromise Georgia's accession to the bloc. The ruling party reintroduced the bill this month. It must now pass at least two more readings in Parliament to become law and one final vote to overcome a presidential veto.